Hey, this is Harry Guinness for Tuts Plus, and this is a tutorial on if this then that recipes for your business. You can see 15 recommended recipes in the written tutorial. In this quick screencast, I'm just going to take you through the process of setting up one of the recipes. The one I'm going to use is this when a specific hashtag is used on Twitter, add the tweet to a Google spreadsheet. Now I don't have my Google Drive channel set up, but I do have my Twitter channel set up. So whenever you're setting up a new if this then that action, you're going to need to make sure that your channels are connected. So I'm going to click connect and then I will need to sign in or select my Google account. That will do. Click allow and that will connect. Once the channel is connected, click done. And then I can set up what I want this uh, recipe to search Twitter for. So I'm going to use my Twitter username, which is at Harry Guinness, two N's, two S's. I should probably learn how to spell my own name. And then I'm going to leave it at the default here, which is all the hashtag. And that's going to say, I'm going to change that to at. So that will be all the at Harry Guinness tweets. Uh, you can manage any fill-ins you want by clicking on that. So you can select an ingredient like the text of the tweet the name of the user or the link to the tweet. We don't really want any of them for the spreadsheet name. If you want to be notified when it runs, you can click that little box. Otherwise, just click add, and that recipe will be added to your if this then that account. And that's that set up. It's that simple. Click on my recipes, and you will see whatever recipes you've got set up. And there's the if uh, the specific hashtag, or in this case, my username is tweeted, then it gets added to the Google spreadsheet. So you can work through the list of uh, great if this then that recipes for your business and just add any you want to your account. Check out the links in the written post for more information on doing just that.